ten seconds sprint. And of course, usually I get into pose well before the time is finished, just so I can breathe and relax. And of course, if I'm slouching, it helps me to get my posture better. <laughs> Reasons why I need a remote. Of course, when you have your back to the camera, it's a lot harder to find out when exactly it's going to shutter. Thankfully for me, I know how to count to ten. Unfortunately, unfortunately for me, this petticoat skirt really sucks. I see a lot of that. One thing you can't actually see is below me I have some slats from my old bed squished together underneath me with the um, yoga pilates mat on top of that and also the white background. So it's actually quite easy to trip and unfortunately I'm a big klutz. Posing, how good is that? Note to self, pick up the petticoat skirt when walking. So anyone saying that stock takes hardly any time walking back and forth from the camera pressing the button, not fun. I envy those stockers that have their own photographer. Best thing about petticoat skirts. Whoop! You didn't see that, and if you tell anyone, I'll deny it. This is the part where it starts getting hot and I start getting out the fans. This would be a whole lot easier if I had more props to choose from. Like a parasol or something. Fuck. Back. Stock is hazardous to your health, remember that. <sighs> Told you impromptu posing. I don't know if you can see this, but I just took the belt off. And I've already got sweat marks where the belt was. That's how hot it is in here. Probably do better with the cloak. I don't know, do you think the goggles go with this outfit? <laughs> 